Hey, welcome back to today's ASMR gameplay, which is old school RuneScape. I never played RuneScape, this is the very first time. I'm scared, I'm scared. Uh, I don't know what to expect. I love this. So let's just Hello. Let's just see what kind of hairstyles I can find. Snowy and Snowy were both not free, so I called my character the Grid Cow, like one of my Tauren. Oh, I love that. You know what? We're just taking this. Or. Yeah, let's just take this. I'm not sure what it is, but it looks fun. Oh, okay, the music got out of nowhere really loud. Have fun editing later. Oh, my girl, my boy, my whoever. Tosso. Do we have something really basic? Oh, look at this, a cropped shirt, I love that. Oh, oh. Wow. Oh. You can customize so much, it's pretty impressive. Yeah, let's just stick to that. Oh. I like the music, the music is really... I never played this game, but it's really nostalgic, <laughs> even to me. I think uh, this is the style. I don't really see a difference in the shoes, but yeah, let's go with these. Oh, oh, now I see the hairstyle properly. Oh, oh, okay. Oh. Yeah, I'm feeling, um, I'm feeling, yeah, that's what I'm feeling. That's a good color. This is actually a pretty color, I'm not even joking. This is kind of a cute combination, this also. I like that. Okay, uh -huh. Oh. Let's go. Okay, let's uh, let's stick to the classic black boot. I think this. I could have been going. Okay, we're fine. We're chilling. I didn't think there's a difference, to be honest. Oh. I want to have my hairstyle again. Where is it? There it is. But now my clothes are kind of not destroyed. Oh. Oh, that was cute. Oh, that's adorable. I like that. No. Oh, it's kind of like my top now. I love that. No, we're going with this. Oh. oh my god, I love the oh oh there it is. Okay, but we don't have much more options. Confirm. It looks like the character is wearing sunglasses. I love that. Let's take a screenshot. How do I move? Oh Jesus. Like that. Use the hero keys on your keyboard. Okay, this is how to rotating the camera. Oh, 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 okay. Oh, this is destroying my brain, but I'll get used to it. Talk. How do I talk to you? 
Monsieur. Oh. Why are you running? How do I talk to him? Are we talking? Is this communicate? What happened to him? Oh, okay. Why can I talk to him? Hello? Friend. You kind of need to, um... Okay. Now we're giving up. We are giving up. Can I leave the building? That's... I thought that's a door. That's a... That's not a door. Ah, oh, there's a door. Why can't I do that? This is just so strange. Oh my god, I just noticed now that it's in a the corner there. I'm stupid. I didn't see it's so tiny in the corner. This is how I talk to the NPC. Greetings. I see our new arrival to the world of Galinor. My job is to welcome all the new visitors. So welcome. You have already learned the first thing needed to succeed in this world. Talking to other people. Yeah, it just took me... 10 minutes. I never pay attention to this unless I know there is something. I expect something like that to be in the middle of a screen. <laughs> I'm a spoiled gamer. You will find many inhabitants of this world have useful things to say to you. By clicking on them, you can talk to them. I figured. Before we get going, if you could be so kind to let me know how much experience you have for old school RuneScape, that would be wonderful. Well, so simply click the choose and answer on the following screen. What's your experience with old school RuneScape? I am an experienced player. I've played in the past, but not recently. I am brand new. This is my first time here. If I'm honest with you, Gail Lenore Guide. I have never played this game, and I'm about to lie to you. I will tell you, I'm an experienced player. Take that. Yeah, look at me. Look at favorite girl talking. Wonderful, thank you. Now then, let's start by looking at your settings menu. I thought you would believe me that I'm experienced. Yeah, sure. Suits perfectly. From the side panel, you can now see variety of game settings. You can also click the old settings button. Mm -hmm. Love that. Yeah. Ah, talk to you. Looks like you're making good progress. The menu you've just opened is one of many. You'll learn about the rest as you progress through the tutorial. Anyway, let's say it's time for you to go and meet your first instructor. Let me go. I want to be a free bird. Oh, now it opens. Oh, damn. Who's this? So I have an expert. Oh. Oh. Walk here. I can swim. Hello again. I don't think we ever spoke. But okay. This makes me a bit feeling freaked out. First up, we're going to do some fishing. There's some shrimp in this pond here. Let's swim catch some. Okay. Specifically this one. Oh, oh, we working? Oh, oh. Not sure how we managed to, um, oh. Well, I'll probably go become a thief. 
Oh, I can't get used to walking with the mouse cursor thing. No, not mouse cursor. Just the mouse click. I've managed to catch some shrimp. Excellent work. Now that you have some shrimp, you're going to want to cook them. <gasps> to do that, you'll need a fire. This brings us to the wood cutting and fire making skill. Okay. Oh. Wow, brutal. Oh, it's back. Tutorial, where do I go? Loose locks, locks. Okay. Oh, oh, who oh, this? Another player, huh? Now that you have some locks, it's time to light a fire. First, click on the tinder box in your inventory. Tinder box? What's that? Then, with the tinder box highlight, click on the logo to use the tinder What's that? I already fail at the. Uh... Oh, that's a tinder box. It's a Streichholzschächtelchen in German. Try to say it. Tschechisches Streichholzschächtelchen. Let's go. Use. Oh. Nice. Use. That didn't sound healthy. Well done, you first cook your first meal. Speak to the survival expert. Oh yeah, no, I don't need a recap. I'll just eat them. Great. Oh, oh, I, I'm not sure how I triggered that. Great. I love the flowers. Oh. She's running kind of wild. Oh no, we have to go there. Uh, it tells me to go to the entrance, right? I understand correctly. Hello. I am here to... You eat the shrimps, okay. Ah, oh, welcome newcomer. I am the master chef, Lou. It is here that I will teach you how to cook food really fit for a king. Okay. I already know how to cook. <laughs> ah, you call that cooking? Okay, he's even worse. <laughs> Some shrimp on an open lock fire. Oh, no, no, no. I am going to teach you the fine art of cooking bread. The master chief gives you some flour and some water. Okay, this game. What do I do with this now? Uh huh. Oh, I made a bread. You managed to bake some bread. <laughs> Sounds so funny. You made your first bread, no? I know. Oh yeah, door. I know. There. My microphone thing is a bit in the way, so it's hard for me to see the map. Oh, you know what? I can zoom out, right? Examine door. Sounds like fun. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I forgot that I can do this one. Have you not opened the menu yet? No, I didn't. 
I can set a script by talking to Willow on the paths of a Ice Mountain. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now that you have the quest list open, you can see all the quests within it. Clicking one of these quests will display some more information on it. If you haven't started a quest, it will tell you where to begin and what requirements you need. If the quest is in progress, it will remind you that what to do next. It's very easy to find quest start points, just look out. For the quest icon on your minimap, you should see one marking this house. Uh huh. Why are you saying so much, my friend? I need to kind of do a quest here. I'm not your mind to quest. Oh, jeez, that's unexpected. Oh, oh, why is he half naked? Oh, oh, oh. where are you running? Hi there, you must be new around here, so what do I call you? Newcomers seem so impersonal, and if we are going to be working together, I'd rather call you by your name. You can call me Favorite Cow. Okay then, Favorite Cow. My name is Desik, and I'm a miner by trade. Let's teach you how to mine. Oh no, I think I zoned out and skipped what he said. I just mine all day. Are you proud? Are you proud, Dizik? Well, what do you have? <laughs> Whatever your name was, I'm sorry. Okay, now. Oh, yeah, it tells me to go there. Everything you want me to do, tutorial, I will do. And something else. Yeah, I'm copper. Tin, okay, I get it. Use furnace. Oh, that looks very hot, don't do that. You made a bronze bar. Can okay, like. Oh, why is she running like that now? I have a bronze bar, what now? Now that you've got a bronze bar, you can smith it into a weapon. To smith something, you need a hammer and an anvil. There are some anvils just here that you can use. See if you can make a bronze dagger. Of course. Oh, that squatting position, I love it. No, 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 please don't recover. I just have to go there. Yeah, I know I can move my keys like that, but that seems like a lot of work. I'm um, a bit too lazy for that. Oh wow, that's giant rats. Why? Are all of these instructors here are half naked? Who stole your clothes? My name is Favorite Cow. Why are you running away? So impolite. You look like a care. Oh, oh. Wow, what a guy. To me, you're just another newcomer who thinks they're ready to fight. I am Vanaka, the greatest swordsman alive, and I'm here to teach you the basics of combat. Let's get started by teaching you how to wield a weapon. Oh yeah, there it is. Oh, look at me, I'm looking uh, fierce and dangerous. Very good, but that little butter knife isn't going to protect you much. Let's get you something a bit better. <laughs> Once you're properly equipped, we can move on to some actual combat. Huh? Okay, I think that's it, right? I can't reach that. 
Mm-hmm. You have to go take this thread. Okay, stop it. How do I get in there then? Why are there? Why of all the reds do I have to take this one? Why can I open the gate? Do you have to talk to him again? No, it doesn't help me. Don't they? I have a bronze dagger, a wooden shield. Did you give me some more? Oh, yeah, bronze sword. Yeah, there we go. No, we still can't. Oh. Okay. Alright. No, it's this one. That's horrible. Poor red. Bones. Yeah. How did I kill a giant rat? I saw you seem better just than I thought. Now that you have grass basic sword plates, move on. Next up, we have range combat. With this, you can kill foes from a distance. With range, you'll be able to attack the rats without entering the pit, meaning they won't be able to fight back. But didn't I tell the game that I'm an expert at this? Oh, that's so unfair, I'm so sorry. Poor rat. To kill an owl? Or oh, what? No, I have to just go there again. Okay. Um, no. <laughs> oh no, I opened Curse Forge by accident. Well, that's a church. Bobos are found in towns across the world. The old school escape community is invited to vote on future game updates. What? What are the members of a scale total 300? I don't have that. Oh my god, I don't know. I don't think I can, um... It would feel bad to vote on something I don't know about. There's a lot of people voting politics and they don't know much about parties either. <laughs> Hello, how are you? No, how are you or who are you? I'm the account guide. I'm here to tell you about your account. What's an account? Your character is your account. It's what you are using to play the game right now. Everyone here has one and some people even have multiple. There's various things you can do with your account, which is where the account management menu comes into play. Let's take a look at it now. Okay. Alright. As you can see, there's a few things you can do with your account. First, you have a membership. All accounts are free to play by default, but if you desire, you can buy membership to unlock members' worlds. These worlds give you access to extra skills, areas, quests, and more. What's a world? <laughs> I know that. The world is what you play the game on. Most worlds can hold up to 2,000 players. They are split into two main types. Worlds and members' worlds. You can swap worlds with the worlds which are in the lockout menu. 
You're currently in a free world. If you want to switch to a member's world and enjoy all the benefits. No, I don't want to do that. But why would I use someone instead of just buying membership? Okay, I don't want that. I'm sorry. Okay. I just skipped that part because he just wants to sell me the membership and I don't want it. Umbrella Brace. Good day, brother. Hello, Umbrella Brace. I'm here to tell you all about prayer. Yeah. Fix skin, increase your defense by 5%. Love that. This is your prayer list. Prayers can help a lot in combat. Click on the prayers you wish to use to. What happened? Why did it skip? <laughs> Strange. Hmm. Activate prayers will drain your player's points, which. No. Prayer points, which you can recharge by finding an altar or of a holy spot and praying there. As you notice, most enemies will drop bones when defeated. Burying bones by clicking them in your inventory will gain you prey experience. I'm also the community officer around here, so it's my job to tell you about your friends and ignore list. I don't think anyone will hit me here, so I just skip that part. I wanna run around in the world. What do I do now? Wizard house? Where is the wizard house? Is that the no, it's dungeons. What? Oh, there's a quest, I guess. Is that a wizard house? What in the world? How do I get there? Is that even where I have to go? Are you sure this is... This is looking like a magic thing? Yeah. Talk to magic, what it's called. Oh. Yes, chicken. Hello. Good day, newcomer. My name is Tervalva. I'm here to tell you about magic. Let's start by opening your magic interface. Currently, you can only cast one offensive spell called Wind Strike. Let's ride out on one of those chickens. I don't like that. Okay. How do I use it? Why can I not? Do you have to like click it every time? Which chicken? Okay. We didn't kill it, just to take it. Well, you... You're all finished, you know. I'll give you a reasonable number of runes when you leave. Yeah, sure. Mainland? Were you planning to become an iron woman, by the way? What's an iron woman? If you're interested in that, you should go and ask the iron man tutor before you leave this island. He's standing outside the house. Alright. Hello, favorite cow. I'm Paul, the Iron Woman Tutor. What can I do for you? When you play as an Iron Woman, you do everything for yourself. You don't trade with up. Oh, yeah, I don't want that. 
I uh, definitely gonna trade so much. <laughs> yes, yes. No, I'm not playing to do that. When you get to the mainland, you will find yourself in a town of Lumbridge. If you want some ideas on where to go next, talk to my friend, the Lumbridge guy. You can miss him. He's holding a big staff with a question mark on the end. He also has a white beard and carries a book sack full of scrolls. That's a German word. I've never heard it in English. There are also many tutors willing to teach you about the many skills you can learn. Prepare yourself. I got a steam achievement. Ah, oh, that's a question mark. Okay, here we are on the mainland. This is my dream. I just wanted to get here. Interesting. We don't attack citizens. Well, that was quite something. I thought I could play a bit more than just a tutorial, but yeah, I'm a bit confused now. I hope you still like this video and let me know how you feel about it. Um, no, no attacking woman. Have a wonderful day or night wherever you are. Stay safe. Bye bye. How to talk to NPC in RuneScape Can talk to NPCs This is just so strange. Oh my god, I just noticed now that it's in a the corner there.